That's a great start. God, look at that temple hello everyone today is a pretty exciting day because I am gonna be making a big purchase today for the longest time I've been wanting to get like some wireless headphones I currently have my airpods but I'm planning on giving them away to one of my family members so they can have so I'm gonna go get some new wireless headphones for me for like the past year, I think, I've been researching what kind of wireless headphones I should get. I was leaning towards getting the Apple Max, wait, the Apple Pro Max, wait. I was leaning towards getting the Apple Max headphones, but after further research, I found out that it's like almost a thousand dollars here in New Zealand absolutely crazy so definitely gonna rule that one out so i continue searching and i think i'm just gonna go with the sony xm5s i was thinking of getting the xm4s but right now since it's back to school there's a lot of sales going on so the xm5s have a really good price at the moment I got it! I'm so excited! This... Oh, I'm just so, so excited. I was thinking of getting the black headphones, but after trying them on in store and seeing what it looks like, I decided to get the silver. <gasps> so pretty! It's the color silver, but it kind of looks a bit light, light gray and it looks so good like oh my god okay this is very very slim this can fit in my bag really easily and then from what i saw in the reviews the cables are in this little pouch here i love how they look like One of my best purchases I've ever made. One of the best. Okay, after the excitement of those headphones, not only did I get those headphones while I was out, but I also stopped by Peter Alexander and they dropped their new collection, which was the Sanrio and Friends collection, if I can remember on top of my head. When I first saw it in front of the store, I, I knew I had to get it. It's a pajama set with the top and the shorts and it comes with this really cute Hello Kitty pouch. So this is what the top looks like. Pajama top with all the Sanrio characters here. It's so cute. So worth it. The material is amazing. Not sponsored by the way. I just really really love Peter Alexander pajamas. Like these are so adorable. I will be wearing this every day. These are what the shorts look like. All in all, very good day, very, very good day.
So I just finished tidying up the desk. Um, it was such a mess. <laughs> so I'm really happy that it's all clean and tidy now. My point of view sitting down here. I finally got myself a laptop stand for my computer over here so it's not all in the way. Finally got the keyboard to work and the trackpad to work. It didn't want to connect to the computer at all. It took me like 20 minutes to do this but it works. As of now, most of my courses are already on Canvas, so I do have to go over the syllabus for all of them and see what I need to do to prepare for the new semester. Maybe I need to look over some slides or anything before that. Oh, I know one of my courses, they sent out a whole list of software I need to download on my computer like i'm not even kidding it was this like it was like two pages of just links of software i need to download it says we recommend you use a windows laptop for personal use and look this is the whole this is the list of what they want us to download all of these are software that I need to download. Basically, most of the things that I need to do before school starts, which is like read the syllabus, go through the coursework, download all this software, but... So I just finished packing this bag for tomorrow, for my first day back to school. I thought I would actually bring a lot of stuff to school, but turns out I don't really need a lot. In terms of weight, it's not that bad. I've had worse. So I'm gonna do a little what's in my bag for tomorrow, for my first day back in uni. It's actually not a lot. It does feel like a lot in here, but it really isn't. It does have a lot of pockets I can use. There's a pocket here and there's like a big pocket with a zipper here, but there's nothing in it because I'm not bringing that much. But I do have my pom pom ring keychain here that I added. So, just on first glance, when you open the bag, I have my laptop. Here it is with all its glory. Next are the two books that I'm bringing for tomorrow. Since it's like the first week of lectures it's going to be more about introductory and what the courses are going to be about and how it's going to run so i'm not going to be taking a lot of notes per se hopefully so just in case i'm bringing a sweet blank notepad with nothing in it and then my planner the next item in here is the most important in this bag which is my essentials pouch inside it's basically essentials so i have like pads, tampons, and from this angle, it looks like I'm just bringing pads and tampons to school. But mostly inside, I have this travel perfume in here and three lip products inside. That's the essentials. I have a mini umbrella in here as well, just in case the weather turns into a rainy day. It is supposed to rain tomorrow, so hopefully this comes in handy. Actually, the most important items in my bag is my wallet and my bus card here. My bus card is a Uno you know, photo card, so it seems like he's paying for my bus rides. And last but not least, my new favorite item, my headphones. I've been using these ever since I got them now, so these are the most important. The time now is 11.30. I am preparing to go to sleep right now since I have to wake up pretty early to go to uni tomorrow. 
which I'm not excited about. You gotta do what you gotta do. In terms of excitement of going back to uni, I'm pretty... If I have to rate it out of 10, I'll be like 5, 6, around there. I think going back to uni is pretty good for me because it puts me back into a routine which I have not been doing since the start of break. I like lost my sleep schedule, lost my time management and all that. I'm a little bit excited though to go back to uni. Most of my classes are pretty manageable except for one important core course that I have to do for my degree. Apparently it's one of like the hardest comp sci courses in the uni. As long as it's like one important core course that I'm doing this semester, I think I'll be fine. I would say this semester is pretty important because this one important core course opens up to more courses in my degrees. So this semester I really have to lock in and put my grind on. <laughs> I'm hoping for this semester to be very easy, very chill. My first year of uni was very an up and down year, I guess, like a roller coaster, because the jump from college to uni was very, very big. I really underestimated that, so that is what took a toll on me. I wasn't able to like balance my work and my life like easily. It was going well towards the end of the year, so I think that's when I finally managed myself and understood how I was gonna live this new life with uni. So hopefully this semester, this year, would be much more balanced and much more easier and less stressful since last year. But I think I'm gonna end it here guys. It's 11.35 which means I should be going to sleep right now. Um, so I need to prepare a few other things, wash my face, brush my teeth and all that so I can wake up, wake up tomorrow, basically. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope everything is going well with everyone and is living a happy, healthy life. I will see you next time. Stay safe and happy. Bye-bye.